start of a new vlog. Hey guys, it is week two in Milan. Um, we're by we're like, out this like Arc de Triomphe vibes. <laughs> Look at it. Arc de Triomphe. Arc de Triomphe. I just know that's not the way you went to say it, but like we no. always said it like it. We're actually like, what is this one actually called? I think it might be called Arc de Triomphe as well. Grace, it is not. I think it is. Arco de la Paz. And obviously Grace went on her date last night, guys. Story time when we get home. Story time when we get home. Really story time, but. You had a nice time, didn't you? Yeah, I did. And he's staying here for another 15 days. Mm. So that's going to be interesting. <laughs> so we're going to do some Instagrams by this lovely, like, arc. Grace's little gym set on. I'm doing what? a brand deal. A little body, like, protector. I'm, like, fucking sweating my ass I love off. this. I think... Do you? I've got it I think it's really cute. I love it. Love it. You I might love it. watch your closet. I might steal it. <laughs> <laughs> We've actually got a really fun week this week, guys. Yeah, our mums are coming. On our Friday. mums are coming. I just think it's coming around so fast. I'm so excited for them to it come. It felt like ages. But they, it didn't feel like. Yeah, it felt like they oh my god, I'm not here for long. For ages. Yeah, and they're literally coming this week. And weekend. then when they come, then we've got another two. How weird is that? When the mums are going here, we've really only, quick. It's almost going too quick. And this week we've also got a photo shoot. Um, I, quite, I get quite nervous for photo shoot. Same. I feel a bit sick about actually. It's not even just the shoot, it's like the people around watching. It's like what and you we've never met this photographer. It could be awkward. We don't know a lot about her. She's used to taking pictures of people, so it shouldn't be awkward. And you know what, like, I, I'm not going to lie, I thought January, anywhere we go, is going to be a bit depressing, because it's like just... Really but guys, it's, like, it's already been so memorable depressing. this summer. <laughs> yeah. It's we've already been, been so here, iconic. Like, oh, it's going to be five days, we've been here for nearly a week tomorrow, so... And it's just been so iconic already. <laughs> I know. It always is. Yeah, it always is. This is why we need a podcast. Wink, wink. We really need a podcast. We, it's like our biggest goal this year is to have a podcast, and it will happen, guys. Manifest we're it. We're going to do it, and we're going to make it. Email our travel. manager saying you want us to do a podcast. <laughs> and we're going to go for a coffee, and we'll get back to you later. <sighs> we're sat for a coffee. It's lush. Look at our view. It's absolutely lush. You had a croissant. Just taste orange. Yeah, it's the best croissant I've ever had. But I'm literally hungry, so I just demolished it. Do you know what like, it? It tasted orange. Like, I don't know if I can see. Coffee here is the best. My best. Simone is the, the best. best, no? The collection is the best. And just look at our view. We're in this like, little square. It's so sweet. We're loving nice. We're nice. The rules don't apply. Not, Not in East London. London. Just got back from the arc. That um, walk was. It was a half an hour long walk. My trainers broke. Her Dior trainers. And we've just been food shopping for the week. Yeah, for the powerful. week, and we've literally got like two things. We're literally buying nothing. We're actually like buying it. We've got some bread. We've got some like salad. Strawberry bits. salad. We have tomatoes. pasta anyways. We didn't need pasta. That's all we're really going to eat. That's it's literally all we eat is like pasta and bread. But anyway, yeah, we're going to basically just unpack all of our shopping. And then Grace is going to do a story time on her date. Story time! Okay, well, again, like Grace said, there's not much to story about, to be honest. It's just a date. It's, it's not like a yeah, wild like night out. Yeah, nothing like major happened. It was just a nice date. <laughs> we went to the place, you know the church, the, the bars with a view of the church. So we went to them. We got a bottle of wine again. Bearing in mind I was hungover. So that was bold for me because I was like, like you when I went, I was like, I don't know if I can even drink. But when I got there, I was, I did feel better. So when she got there, she was like, I was like, I need some wine. And then we went to this other restaurant for desserts and another bottle of wine. You got so, back quite late. You got back about half ten. No, eleven. Did I get back at eleven? Yeah, because I'm only being like, bitch, I need to go yeah, to bed. Yeah, because you was worried about me. Like you were like, this where is, is like she? typical Grace, right? So she literally said before she left, she said, if it's half ten and you've not heard from me, be worried. So was you? I text her at 9 o'clock, no answer. I text her again at 10, no answer. So it's half 10, I text her again, no answer. Oh, I feel really bad That's now. really shit stuff from you. So I was like, oh my God, I think she's dead. So I call her, no answer. So I'm about to call her mum to be like, <laughs> Grace has gone on a date and she's dead. Because she literally said to me, if it's half 10 and I'm not And calling. if it's 11. <laughs> and it was like 11. And I still have so I, like, I was literally so close <laughs> to calling her mum and then she texts me back and I was like, I literally want to kill you. Like, you're so, actually so annoying. <laughs> like, all you have to do is tell I was so dramatic. Now. I was like, Grace. If it's half ten and I'm not here and I don't text you, be worried. Are you gonna go on in a second? Sorry, yeah, no shit so. siren. <laughs> don't mind me. You are. Yeah. Stop. Um. But yeah, we're just gonna chill now, basically. And we'll catch up with you guys later. 
not us both doing the peace sign. Hey guys! Hey! It is <coughs> Sorry. Tuesday. We're gonna go to all the vintage shops in um, Brera. They have loads and loads of vintage shops in Brera for some reason. So that's basically what we're doing all day is vintage shopping. And we've seen it on TikTok and it looks like everything's like Fendi. We've done two out of <laughs> I don't know how many stores. Um, like there's loads. Stores, so we're gonna Just... keep going. We'll probably grab some lunch. Yeah, we'll probably Please. see you guys next time we're at lunch. Yeah, because we'll be vlogging. Oh my god, we're, at, we're always I'm so hungry. We're yeah. always starving. It's actually really bad, but yeah. But look how pretty all these little streets are. So we're sat down for some lunch. Some. We're so hungry, but it's only like quarter to twelve. So we have a chocolate croissant, and then we don't know what this is. It could Should be I try jam. And lick it? it could be if marmalade. it's marmalade. I'm not going to be impressed. I hope it's apricot jam. It could be marmalade though. Oh, even better. That's our favourite jam, guys. I think, I think. It's at this really cute place. We literally we walk past, past here. And, we're like, and there's always, like, cute hot girls. And we're like, yeah. that could be us. There's always, like, trendy people. Yeah. Like, and they have the most amazing cakes. Oh, my God. It's just a good vibe in there. It's so rock and roll. So, we've come home. And we're having some pizza from this pizza place we got on the first day. It's probably the best pizza thing we've ever had. And then we ordered this, like, thing that we thought was pasta. But it's not. It's a ball of whatever. Oh, oh it's on the loose. Should we um, it so it's, it's like we thought it was gonna be pasta. We but ordered it's a ball. Ca cacio pepper, and this is what we got because it was two euros. It must have it in. It does look good. Like I, it, it does look quite good. Let's not lie. It must have it inside, like cacio. Pepper yeah, that's inside. all cacio pepper flavored. And I said cacio pepper. She was like cacio. Did you hear Oh that? yeah, because it's, it's meant to be. It's definitely not cacio prepared. No, but that's how we say it. Oh my god, guys. Night here with the bestie. We have got McDonald's and we have not tried McDonald's yet. Oh my god, you, you guys don't even know how to Italian. Unboxing. Okay, okay. We don't know what each other got, so go on. So, I've got one of these biscuit things. Bearing in mind that most McDonald's in England don't do this sort of thing. There's a, a whole cafe. Yeah, it's like a dessert section. So I've got one of these biscuits. I then have got... <gasps> you ready? Yeah. Tiramisu. Oh my God. Because oh, I love tiramisu. And I was thinking like, in what world can you get a tiramisu at McDonald's? And then I got the mozzarella thing. It's like... It, it looks like a folded pizza. It's like a calzone. Yeah, like. And they also had it in like bites form, but I just didn't know which one. I think I went for the giant one. It's three. Mmm. They're like calzone. Yeah, they're like kind of. Pizza. I think they're like pizzas. Yeah. <gasps> um, and then I got chips, just normal chips. So okay. I'm, I'm really excited to eat that. I got the same calzone to spread. Then I got cheese fries. Mmm. Oh my god. They also had like bacon, didn't they? Yeah, a bit funky. A bit funky. I wouldn't really trust that McDonald's bacon, to be honest. Then, light grey. I got a jammy dodger. But I also <gasps> got. Great minds. Great minds think like. Hazelnut is... one. Because it, I love like Nutella. But one more thing. I'm not actually a big McFlurry girl. But look at that. Yes, McFlurry. you are. You love McFlurries. No, because usually I find them too cold. But look at that McFlurry. What's it got? What flavour is it meant to be? I couldn't understand a word because it was all. It looks but... like Stracciatella ice cream. Yeah, I think so. That looks amazing. It is the next day. Right, sorry for the iPhone. Oh, you know what? We even might need to do a story time. Like I think we're going to have to. We just because... finished doing a photo shoot and it was so interesting. I've got so much to tell you. I think but... we're going to have to, like, we're on the camera. We'll give you guys, like, a full oh, lowdown. Um. But we're at this restaurant, it's so sweet, it's in the gallery and we shot we like were shooting here and they were so nice we to really us. We, even, well, we didn't have to talk about it and we smashed a sugar pot. And I just felt so bad and like oh, so we've like decided to eat here. Because we just felt really, really bad. nice. And the food it looks amazing as well. Grace has a Pomodoro. I'm really jealous of that to be honest. I've got a French onion soup because it's my favourite thing to have in Paris and I really, really miss it, so we're just gonna eat this and then we'll head back and give you guys we'll a full lowdown. I'm excited to see the pictures. We're going to get them tomorrow, apparently. So we can show you guys the pictures. Yeah. The outfits we did were this. And then all the outfits are part of the story time, so I'm not going to show the outfits. But. Hey, bitches. Hey. We're now back from lunch. So. Actually, I thought we were going to tell you the story about the shoot. Yeah. So we had the photo shoot this morning at 10 a.m. So you can't be like, well, it felt like the crack of dawn, didn't it? It did feel like the crack of dawn. I don't it know wasn't. why, but I'm just more tired here. But it was just a very interesting shoot. So we got there and like, like 
she knew what she liked, which is obviously great. But like, say we would suggest something, it would always be like, no. We thought, book a shoot, do it shoot. together. Because in Paris, you guys love the pictures. So exactly, like, like the, the Paris pictures turn out so well. So we're like, our plan is to book it for every single destination we go to, it's a photo shoot. So of course, we got there and like, to start with, she was like, your outfits make no sense. She was, I like, was she, was like, pants. she was like, your coat? She was like, take it off. Bearing in mind, I was wearing like, like your outfit literally is a plain. She was like, your outfits don't make sense. She was like, they don't make sense. What is going on? She was like, she was like this is just not making sense. She really dissed my outfit. She was like, she, what did she say? She kept going to me. She was like, you, you're a rock star. You're fashion week. And then she would just like, look at Grace and be yeah, like. Yeah, she'd look at me and say nothing. She was, like, take she was trying off. to get me to take my car off, but I was not prepared to do that. Because this is this was my favourite thing out of the look. And, and then, then she kept just going to grow. She's like, you need she's to like, like you're not posing them. properly. Which, to be fair, I'm not a good, I'm not good at posing. At posing. But then it, but it, she, I just felt, I literally felt like crying. She went to me and she's like, right, you need to stand, she needs to practice. And for like 15 minutes, she would just like make gross. I was near tears. Like practicing. Like, like I didn't even want to do singular pictures. That's not what we paid for. So she's like, she's like, you need to practice, and then like made Grace just like. And like walk. for the rest of the shoot, she made us do separate pictures. Yeah. For most of the most of the looks, because she obviously just didn't think our styles meshed. But like, like a beige she, trench coat goes with anything, so it goes. And I was like, it's our. I think I was, I was like, it's our thing that we like, kind of dress different. Like it's kind of what we're known for. And like, it just really made me laugh the whole thing. Like she just like could not fathom our outfits together. No. She? Kept telling Grace to stop she touching wanted, her hair. Because yeah, I like to touch, when I take photos, I think. Or Grace does. Because I never, I don't want to have my hands by my side. I want them either like candid. By my hair or like, you know. She's like, like stop touching glasses. Her. She kept, like if I would like put my hand anywhere near my hair, which is what I liked, I like doing photos like this. Like, She'd be like, there. stop. She'd be like, ah, your hands. She was just very specific. And then we, we got into this cafe. Oh my God. Oh my God. So we got into this cafe and like, the, they were really kind. Like they let us shoot in there. Cause I think no one was eating yet. Like it was kind of open, but not open. Oh, it gives me shivers. Um, and like, she just, she started like just dragging the tables around the restaurant. Like, like oh, oh, the so sugar she, smash. She pulled like one of the tables and didn't move the sugar in the middle. And it just it went everywhere. Middle. And she didn't even help pick it up. I picked it all up. I couldn't even Because I, I felt too bad on this poor I man that let us take photos of like his restaurant. And then this girl was like smashed his sugar pot. We've only ever done like the parachute. We're and not, she was we're so not used to like, you know, having pictures taken of us by a photographer. We're not used to like getting told what to do. Like even in Paris, like she had a vision, but she went about, about it a bit more like gen gen gently. And she kind of let us do like if we were like we want them here. That's what was done. Oh my but God. This woman had a vision. No, it, how much courage did it take? Like we had to keep saying no. We want pictures, but sat down. We want pictures, sat down. We had to be so certain. We were like I was like no. We want pictures together now. It was just like a very different shoot experience. Like Grace was like nearly in tears at the first. I outfit. didn't. I wanted to go home. Grace looked like, to me. She was like I'm going to start crying because she literally like singled Grace out for like <sighs> 15 minutes. She was like you can't pose. She was like you need to pose properly. And like it made me even probably worse at posing. Because then you became awkward. I just became awkward and like didn't want to even try and I just felt, I just was like, I felt really like shit basically. Like I'm in a shit outfit. I, yeah, I just felt rubbish. She was nice towards the end. She was really nice actually towards the end and she, I think she just had a very different shooting style we're not used to. That's basically all we've been doing. It's like two o'clock. And then we sat by the church, which we do. We every love doing day. this. We love just sitting in the sun by the church and talking for ages and, and people just laughing watching. and seeing what everyone's wearing. Yes, we literally do it every single day. It's like the highlight of our day. We just sit. Um, but yeah, now we're back home. Just put a wash on. Grace is going to edit a video. Um, and then that's basically. I think we're going to have for dinner tonight. Oh my god! Tell them how funny the dinner thing is. So basically, there's a restaurant directly opposite our um apartment the man was like this is the best food you'll get in milan like it's so good it's all food from rome like, that's this is the best food there was a specific get. thing he told us to order but i can't remember and we were like he's obviously going to say that because he obviously talks he was like this is yo you know like he he's from yeah, rome and like, like rome shit. food we, and he was like yeah but he was like obviously if he's friends with him he's going to tell us that to try and make us eat there but like then we found it on like this girl's like review and she like she said it's like the best. It's like the best. Italy. They said they did the best catch ever. I'm bumping. So that's basically what we're doing. We're not going to book it, are we? No, I don't think so. No way. 
All right, well, we'll see you guys later. Peace out. So we're going out tonight for dins. Um, there is a male coming. It may be the male that Grace went on a date with. <laughs> Silence. <No. laughs> Silence in the room. We literally look the same. We're in. I know, we're always in the same outfit. Blazers and black tops. You wear black tops. Um, Grace is wearing shorts. That's the only difference. Leather shorts. And loafers. And I'm wearing suit trousers. All right, guys. We're going to go and eat loads of pasta. pasta. Yeah. Holy shit. So, okay, right. So, we just went on like this dinner and then drinks with a boy that Grace went on a date with and he just stormed off. Because we thought, let's all go out together. He's met Grace before. And I mean, I didn't get asked on a second date, so I just thought this could be like a nice way to see him again without me asking him on a date. So it was all going so fun and well. It was going really well. It was really funny. I thought like throughout the Milan trip, we'll probably see him. And it's all, he's and, ruined like, I, it. I, you know what? I did actually like him. But he stormed so off. So basically, I re-downloaded Hinge because I number one wanted to see if he had because I think you can see on it. If number else fucking has two. It. She's been on two dates with him. If I want to, I can re-download Hinge. So then all her Hinge notifications started to come up, and he was like, "You re-downloaded Hinge." And then I was like, "You've been on one date. Like she can re-download <laughs> no, Hinge if I'm she not wants." Even but he, you know what? It makes so much sense. He's a Pisces. He got up and I, I'm so used to Pisces behaviour. It's Pisces behaviour. He was like, "I'm ordering like, an Uber." I was like, "What are you doing?" He was like, "I'm ordering an Uber." I was like, "What?" He was, he was like, like, "Oh yeah, I'm going. Make sure you get, get home safe. I'm off." It was like and, really passive uh, and we were like, are you joking? Because we were having a really good time. We were like, are you joking? He was like, no, was like, I'm coming. How weird is that? So weird. So fucking like, weird. Like over an app that I've not even dated anyone off of. And I've been on one date with you. I'm really baffled by the whole thing. So that's been our evening. And we're both quite drunk because we've had about six shots and two cocktails and a bottle of wine. So we're going to bed now, but we'll see you guys tomorrow morning. Nice. It's just what been was a that? Hi. Hey. It is so, Thursday. We are up. We, we kind of had like a no makeup, chilled out cafe night. Like, yeah. I'm just going to sit here and eat loads of food, basically. Yeah. Um, so last night was interesting. You guys had the story time. He's sent a message apologising for storming out and having a tantrum and that he's embarrassed. We've learned from this that we only date Swedish boys. So we're at our favourite little bakery. We've been here this week already but we love it. Oh we're obsessed. It's such a good vibe and always bringing out like freshly baked stuff. Loads of stuff. We so. have a croissant, we have a cookie. We have this jam like We thought it was cake. cake. It's like a cheesecake but I'm not complaining. We love jam. It looks so good. Roasted cappuccino, I've got sparkling water. It's good oh, vibes. We love it nice. Okay, so we're going to live react to our our photo shoot pictures now the evening because you can't tell God. so you guys obviously remember the story time with the photographer <laughs> oh that's a bit fresh now isn't it oh my god okay <laughs> we're just silent she's actually sent a lot Okay, we're now just watching a film. He's just not that into He's you. He's just not into you. It's a, it's a rough film because I feel like it is it's kind, it's of, kind us. of us. Morning, guys. Good morning. We're having a really wholesome morning because we've just gone and got some flowers. <laughs> we've got some tulips. The mums are joining us today at 1 p.m. How weird. I can't, I actually can't find that they're going to be like in our apartment. I'm so excited to see them. Like, it feels like so it's been I. so long, but it has it. So it should be a week. A week and then I, two I, days. A week and a bit. Um, but yeah, we're off to see our mums. Well, they're off to see us today at 1pm. But yeah, we're going to get some pictures of the tulips and then we'll see you guys when we get back because we need to like clean the apartment yeah, before the mums arrive. Guys, look how mature we are. We've put tulips in a vase. We're so mature like that. We're waiting for our mummies. They're still not here. They had a delayed landing because apparently there's fog, which is actually no, a really it's foggy day. No, it's been very today. delayed. It's been very delayed. They're meant to be here about 38 minutes ago, so... Come on. I'm actually chop, chop. starved because we were like, oh, we're not going to have lunch until they arrive because we'll go for lunch with them. But fucking hell, my belly's rumbling. I'm rumbling my stomach. We should have got McDonald's. We were going to get like we, a we going to get like, or something from McDonald's. But we thought, we'll wait. Last time I ever do that. I'm never trusting them again. <laughs> they've, they've lost all trust. Truly. Grace talking to a really hot boy on Tinder. He's 
sweetie. <laughs> no, because I, I guess I can't say all the details because I get scared that like somehow I'll get found out. Well, no, not I'm scared that like he'll see me talk about him. And be like, anyway, what weirdo. But he's Swedish, um, which is Grace's ultimate. Because Tinder, I never normally find anyone I fancy. Guys, I just wish we had, like, when we start, we're going to start a podcast, hopefully. And once we start that, you'll get all of the tea. You will get all of the by tea. By then, we probably won't care. Like, realistically, none of these yeah, people are But, like, right so. now, we're in Milan. So, it's like, we, we can't could run really, into these people. We can't really talk too much about it. But by the time we do the podcast, it'll be like, we'll be back from we'll Milan. Be, like, yeah. We'll never see them again. So, we can actually tell you the details. Guys, look who's here. It's only Nicola and Emma. They've arrived in Milan. I thought you were going to say that. We're out for lunch and Randy from Say Yes Address is behind. So that's why we're all like starstruck. Anyway, yeah, we're out for lunch at this really cute little like bistro in the gallery. Everyone is so starstruck. The woman was too stunned to see. <laughs> okay, guys, but look how cute. I'm, I love it. <laughs> Get it together. Get it together. Are you really going? <laughs> Ten forms out, so we're trying to get forms and it's like my number, name and number. Wow. Guys, look at this chance is it? Right, we're all still like fooning over seeing Randy from Sayest's yes address. Guys, he was lovely. Was so we got a picture nice. with him. He was so sweet. He should have vlogged it. So cute. He would have been in the vlog. He could have said, Grace and Grace are in Milan. Like in our new intro. He would have said yeah. yes. Oh my God, he would have They've given that. us this free little... Oh my God, how Look how teeny tiny the cookies. It tastes like um, Cookies and cream. It's so good. We're in Bath and Body Works. So the mum's are literally clearing out Bath and Body Works. Look, and this has all got a cone arcade. They haven't, they've they've only got, got, got handlage. Like Look at all of this. It's all coming home with oh us. My God. And Grace's suitcase is already overweight. <laughs> so the money that I'm gonna have to pay is getting charged directly to these homes. <laughs> Guys, we're out for this dinner. We're at our favourite place. We were here exactly this day last week. It is amazing in here. I don't know what the name is, but we're here with the Mummagers. We've had our dinner. We're having wine. We're having tiramisu. We'll show you guys the tiramisu because it's incredible. Wow. <laughs> Thank oh God. God. <laughs> Trinket. So we're having um, breakfast at Navini Plate. Yeah, the little like Venice, Venice place. Thing. I'm from this place, but look how cool it is. The table has a sewing machine. Look at the menus. Why are they laughing like, like that? Me. <laughs> no, they are. <laughs> It's so like old fashioned. It's just so sweet. Like look. We're now out for lunch. We just walked around Brera. Yeah. You can see them cook the pasta. It's all homemade. We just eat it. Wow. I've not had one of these. Me. It is so cool. Above the gallery. Oh, do I don't actually pronounce it. it. begins with M. Um, oh. We've already got into some little knife and forks. Look, so you can see the whole like view of the gallery. And oh my god, the pastries look incredible. Like, look how cool this restaurant is. Okay, so this is what the cafe looks like. And then all the cakes are all in the right selection. Don't mind me. We are out for dinner. It is stunning. Like, look at all of this. How pretty. So cute. And we've got a little cheese. Board. We've got our wine. This wine is like almost red. It's a bit but it tastes good, doesn't it? Go down at water. Here are the mums. That looks so good. Fancy coffee at the Four Seasons. It is Sunday, 
and it's, it's a month past day. But they're only seventy. Full day. Yeah. And um, we've been reaching around all of the nice like design shops. Yeah. This but look at the Four Seasons. It's actually incredible. Just for a little coffee. Guys, look. We got free biscuits. These are like Maryland cookies. I know we were saying it's like Maryland. We're so gassed. Hey bitches. Hey, oh my so god, I've broken up so much in my forehead. What is going on? Ignore that. Grace is titting her brows, or have you wiped it off? I've wiped it off now. So we are literally so tired. We've actually had such a busy weekend. Um, so this is the end of the vlog. Like this time we don't actually have a story time, which is kind of sad, but. It's, it's like kind of traditional for us to have a story time. Yeah, but, but we our don't. Our weekend's been spent with our mums. Like really, what do you expect us to do? There is a potential date. Is there a date for you? No. It's going to for Grace though. Tomorrow night. There was going to be tonight, but the mums left quite late, so it didn't happen. But there could be a story time next week. So we'll do a little prayer because I know how much we you need guys some love story times. Like, we need to go on dates for the vlog. To talk yeah. about the dates in the vlog. Um, but who knows? Just who make knows? sure you watch the next one. Who knows how vlog. the wind's going to blow? Exactly. So we hope you did all enjoy this one. And It's been a blast. It's been a pleasure. We will see you in next week's vlog. In next week. Bye. Bye.